All right, let's do this. I hope the audio levels are good, but hey, this is my E3, um, I guess, reaction or something. I have not recorded in a while, so... <laughs> I'm excited because it, the, I heard a new vi virus revealed in this. I wonder if this could be like Sephiroth where we can actually like, if we beat the CPU of it, then we can get it early. But I don't know. I highly doubt it. This was supposed to be a watch party. So like if you hear other like random voices, then they're just coming into this call. Speaking of calls. Burp. Hey, it does. How's it going? What's up, PC? <laughs> <laughs> I'm very excited for this. You excited? Yeah. I, I should have watched the other ones, but the other, like, Conferences, but oh well. Hey, yo, quit moaning. Yo, how you doing? Good, you? I'm doing pretty alright. Ooh, it's Playing about to start. <laughs> the burp is stand. What are you hoping for in this direct? Okay, cool. Um... I really don't know. I'm hoping Crash can actually get into Smash. Aren't there like... It would be definitely be interesting. I'm what are you excited hoping to for? see announcements and stuff. Yeah. Or, uh, like new games and stuff. How much you want to bet they're gonna delay Breath of the Wild too? <laughs> probably, probably like a lot because they probably are gonna delay it. Yeah. Would it be like the, for the new character, do you think it's gonna be like the Sephiroth thing, where if you beat the CPU of it, like, you can get the character early, or something? What's up everybody um, and welcome to E3 Live probably, Los Angeles, uh, maybe. I'm not so sure they would do that again. <laughs> they didn't for Pyro. I don't know, honestly, because they could do, like, I don't know. We finally made it. <laughs> I don't know. There's there's a lot that they could do with it. Him, her, it. Yeah. As long as like most of the direct isn't like here's some new JRPG you don't care about. <laughs> um. <laughs> Do do that a lot. The media panel's been great, and yeah, it's that thing of it's gone in the blink of an eye for us, right? I like know. Come and gone once again. I know. Here's and then, new. like, <laughs> the, the new Smash Bros. character is like some side character from oh, said like new JRPG. That is true. But it's just gonna be like one of those, like, stuff that we were talking like about background about characters or something. <laughs> Before we talk about oh. where we're going today, okay, okay, where were okay, we okay, okay. for one reason? I mean, reason. that's kind of what they did with uh, Hero. Redfall. It that is true. Like, sort of, well, he was more made to just, like, advertise, um, 
guts, baby, and blood. Okay, okay. Come I mean, yeah, Spring... That was for me, though. Man, I, I mean, like Springman like was the main character for ARMS, but here we are with Min Min. Like, what is standing out <laughs> yeah. And I was like, wait, let me look through my well, tweets. Well, they can't... That came out much later. That is true, but... ARMS was one of the games that came out alongside the Switch. Yeah, that and is true. I think it was true. like ARMS, Luigi's Mansion 3, E, 1, 2, Switch, and Smash. Like, those are the on-release Nintendo games. And then it was next, you know, we get they were all soon. pretty okay. Year, we're yeah. Cafe I was gonna say so cat like, cafe for me, but all about it. so much great stuff going on. But we have been having so much fun, and we are so happy you. I like that Sakurai already knows it's the characters. Year, That's they're gonna come into Smash. The like but he already like shows them all. Enjoy the announcements and reactions all from the comfort of your own home. The thing and about the Sakurai home, that I kind of don't understand. Is um, he's like the face of Nintendo, isn't he? More yeah. or less. Um, I think he might be. I don't know. It, it's like he's like when you think of Nintendo pe people who work at Nintendo, you think of Sakurai, right? It's because he's like. You know, I mean, some some people think of Reggie though. Like sometimes, like, the, the end in quotes, like it could be Reggie. Yeah, because we know it is happening okay. on the day California is reopening. Yeah, like you know, we we went out to dinner like last Reggie. night. And they were moving the tables inside. And they uh, the the, like, oh, right, like, the person who out. made the uh, please no Johns meme. We talked about the mayor of LA coming in and saying, "Hey, guess what? Next year, E3 is back we're in back. LA." But yes. again, let's not look that far into the future. Let's look at <laughs> oh, the future no. of today. Sorry, I'm getting sappy. You can look at today's schedule oh, right I'm here. I'm tired. At I'm also distracted. <laughs> it starts at 11, right? In just about 25 minutes. Um, I think so. So <laughs> we got half an hour of the pre-show. Bandai Namco presents House of Ashes, mm -hmm. the Dark Pictures anthology. I'm so on. excited for that. Are you gonna screen share it on Discord? It's GameSpot. Or I should probably do that real quick. <laughs> what's your plan? Sure of what's going on. Um, that wasn't enough. We have these on here. I don't know if I can get the audio, but. We, of course, will I can at least try though. Awards. That's right. The most anticipated games from all your I mean, I can just go on to YouTube and watch the live right stream. It's, it's on Twitch. I have no idea what we're gonna see. That might be a problem. I don't know if I have Oh, I do have Twitch. Nintendo is coming, everybody. Oh, I screen shared it anyways. It's gonna be really laggy, but let's bring in the rest of our crew and that's Alex Goldenboy Mendez hanging out with our friends and media partners. Hi. Hello, and Greg, yes, oh, I no, I can hear it. but I stink of success. That's right. Is it like no one is low? Do you want me to turn up? You're incredibly loud. <laughs> Not get enough of this. He's probably yeah, good. Just open it up on my Twitch. Yeah, I was about to say, this is not I mean, working. Well, yeah. I mean, it was working just fine. It's just the fact that you are insanely loud. That I am protruding from my body. Uh, so, we got final day of action here at E3, guys. And, you know, we are expecting some big news to. I did put the link in, the, okay. in chat, so. Throughout the day. Uh, but, you know, I oh, want to talk about, you know, the big moments that we've already wow, seen this Jesus. week, right? Like, uh, a lot has stood out. Uh, there were, you know, personal favorites for myself. Uh, Damon, I guess we'll start Say with you. What, what was your, uh, you know, personal favorite favorite moments, I guess? Uh, a couple of things stick out. I'm a big Far Cry fan. There's not much you have to do to get me excited about a new Far Cry. Just let me know that. Say something. Got... Okay, I'm on board. And Far Cry 6 already yeah. had their own event recently, so coming into E3, I wasn't really sure okay, what they cool. were going to have for Far Cry. E3 now, Day 4? They have this whole other mode where they're bringing back previous villains. <laughs> I'm surprised E3 Day 5. <laughs> Tomorrow. Whoa. Back in place and gonna let I can't wait play to play as the villains in some sort of new mode or new campaign. So that was a big surprise for me. I got an ad. Uh, Whoa! To experiment and do fun things with Far Cry, so that's a DoorDash ad. <laughs> Trust me, it's still like 20 minutes before the direct, so you're all good. They're just talking about their favorite moments. I think they've got a good grasp on these characters. Most of the jokes. Their favorite moments from the last direct or things that have happened. Yep. Yeah, that popped out for me right away. What the heck is Cat Cafe Manager? Also joining us again. 
Uh, oh, yeah, hold on, hold on. They, they spoiled it. Ryu Hayabusa or Hayabusa comes to Smash. What about you? What's been your your standout for you three? What? The, the, the bomb thing, like, spoiled it. They said that Ryu Hayabu, uh, Hayabusa is coming to Smash. I don't know who that is. Hayabusa. It's from... I need this now. And there were so many they're, really cute they're talking about Resident Evil 8 right now. I, I know, but like earlier, earlier at the like bomb thing, it, it like spoiled it. It's basically, they're putting in the main protagonist of Tecmo's Ninja Gaiden. They're putting in the protagonist of Ninja Gaiden? Yeah. Anything Lady D related, you know what I total speculation. I mean, it, that th this is this looks like a pretty cool character, but I'm just waiting for some like little kid to like ruin it. Nintendo, please make Luigi and Bowser couple today. Yes, yeah, no, that's a tweet up on the bottom. We're not going down that rabbit hole again. Yo, if Bowser and Luigi are a couple, bro. Yeah, what did you like? Well, whoa, Bowser and Luigi made out on stream. What? <laughs> <laughs> Ubisoft press conference Bowser and Luigi colleagues here in have the child very smartly speculated Splatoon 3 hype <laughs> yeah it I really hope that this Nintendo Direct isn't like 90% some new stupid ass JRPG and then like the smash reveal a teaser for um Breath of the Wild 2 and then that's it yeah I hope it's not that now in video game form, I hope I, I hope they put in like Breath of the Wild too soon. Like I'm actually I actually like feel bad for uh, Zelda fans. Yeah, I want news on Splatoon three. I want Punch Out news. We all want Switch Sports. <laughs> We all want Switch Sports or some other game based around me because we just have Metopia. What if they added the Yakuza protagonist? Wow, really? Okay, because I just like the final slot. The final slot is the Yakuza probably. That would be interesting because Yakuza is such an interesting game. So Microsoft had a wild presentation. But yeah, I, I am going to post this to my YouTube channel. So if you do like look back in the recording, like I did like highlight like the bomb thing, like saying that what character it was. Yeah. Pretty sure Jason's also recording this as well. Yeah. I mean, I'm just, is it going to end up recording my voice as well? Do you want your voice recorded? I mean, will it? Yeah. Okay, I'm okay with that. <laughs> I was about to say, we're, we're just going to stop the recording then. <laughs> oh, no, what I thought it was, so, okay, it wasn't the announcement at the bottom. The bottom is just a bunch of tweets. Oh, okay, never mind then. Hashtag, so. Someone just said that because someone just said hashtag Crash Bandicoot for Smash and it popped up, so I think, yeah. Oh, okay, never mind. So, was it a spoiler? No, close one. <laughs> I was about to be real disappointed. <laughs> Oh yeah, the yeah, Xbox oh, fridge. I need to get a mini fridge when I go to college. <laughs> As surprised I don't have one. Well, I'm not big on like uh, just drinking. That's all. That's all wrong. But yeah, um, oh yeah, is there Halo Infinite news? Because that game is pretty exciting. I think there might be. I, I'm not too sure on it, on that one, but oh well. I mean, that's like the one thing Microsoft is working on is the new... Uh, Halo. You know, this is different. This is actually, uh, this one looks better. And better Minecraft updates. Also, but Minecraft is kind of like their say. own I mean, separate Starfield, thing, I guess. Obviously. I mean, come on, guys. Yeah. Starfield. Like, we're all really happy. But we all know what I'm really gonna say. Halo. Uh, Halo. Uh, Halo. Uh, Halo. <laughs> Halo. Yes. It was great. I, I mean, overall, though, 
Lots of great uh, announcements. Of course, let us know uh, what your favorite Namco was is still making E3. games. Oh yeah, they are. 2021. Okay. You'll pop up in the ticker uh, down below here. We want I forgot that Capcom still made games, but then I remembered that really Capcom is Resident up. Evil. You know, oh, should I tweet, tweet at E3 to see, try to get my thing out the bottom? Yeah, yeah, do it. Say like Fortnite like, Man for Smash Stop or something stupid. Yeah, I got enough. Yeah, but anyway, folks, we are just getting started today with Nintendo, and they're sure to bring down the house. But they aren't the only high-profile presentation on the schedule. When we come back, we're actually going to preview Bandai Namco presents House of Ashes. We'll be back in just. A few if they make an Ocarina of Time remake, that would be interesting. Yeah, that that'd be really interesting as well. Like. Probably a link to the past. I, I'm just waiting. Past. Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. That was the I, I'm just waiting for like so many YouTubers yeah, to be like, Yo, I was doing the Bajora's Mask Remastered or something. I don't know. Corner to, <laughs> yeah. To explore. You or like, uh. Find something cool there. I don't know, yeah, I mean, so they could do it. Anyway. And it's kind of what. Legend of Zelda really CDI really games really remastered. Ocarina of Time. <laughs> I just remember that being a crazy adventure for me. I remember when I was younger, I was so scared of playing single player. I like how it just says like 1532 so Nintendo. Beautiful. The music to this day is just world class. It's absolutely some of the absolute best music in video games ever. New Horizons is like, I really got into it around. Hold up. <laughs> and Hold on. It's like such an incredible feeling. Of the frick? <laughs> if I could make music for a game, it'd be. Animal. Oh, it's T-Pain. Oh, nice. It's a lot of mixtape. <laughs> It's T Pain. Uh, he's a streamer on Twitch, so I'm surprised he actually made it in. <laughs> Did they just like somehow turn on like my webcam? Just like, uh, uh, face reveal, uh, <laughs> take me off, please. <laughs> uh, video fun, video game fun, video game fun, yeah. Yeah, hype, uh, crash. <laughs> It's gotta be the greatest game ever. Uh, Master Chief for Smash. Uh, and then you pass uh, out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about <laughs> then you just pass out. Just pull hungry box. Just like pass out, and then just like come back like 15 seconds later. <laughs> Sweat just like drips down your forehead like relentlessly. Your shirt gets all soaking in it. <laughs> what is this a new computer or something? Your face is all red and um, everything. <laughs> you have, um, First time I really felt like I was truly immersed in something, not just playing. What something. is this? A new headphone company? It's like magic. It's revolutionary. Or a new streaming service? Probably. Uh, Arms it's probably... three. Someone just said Arms three in the chat. Arms three. There's <laughs> not even an Arms two. <laughs> Hands. <laughs> Hands. A PS5. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, fancy. Whoa, that dude for Smash? <laughs> <laughs> Your living room for Smash? Whoa. Final Is Smash a throws a couch. <laughs> or Is couch explodes. Modern Warfare for Smash? That'd be pretty cool. Captain Price for Smash? What is this? The Bonfire app? Whoa, Flex. So that is the the sleeping emotes. One's bored. Resident sleeper. <laughs> Honestly, I, that is what's happening right now. It's just a resident sleeper. Well, we got a whole twelve minutes until Nintendo. Or two Nintendo. We we gotta clarify that. Yeah. Until Nintendo, but we don't know what Nintendo is planning they could be like all right guys so we set up nuclear devices in every country and it's up to you to de deactivate them and save the world you have 24 hours go <laughs> we set up nuclear <laughs> devices and the only way to deactivate them is to beat every cpu in smash <laughs> we're gonna give you a fresh new smash uh account 
All right, guys, so we're planning to do something big this year. We're going to go back to the basics. So we decided to reset everybody's Smash account from zero. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'll, I'll be depressed. <laughs> we can experience the game all over again. That is going to happen. Like, once the final reveal, once, like, the final, final character, like, comes out, like, they're going to, like, either get rid of all the characters. <laughs> Like we only have three months. Smash Brothers. Like once you get them all into Elite Smash, you just reset. <laughs> but you get, but you get like an extra like trophy or something. Because we just get like fifty trophies because like, <laughs> like we just keep. You get a new spirit. You get Sakurai as a spirit. <laughs> and then you do it again, and you get Reggie, and then Bowser, and so on. Would would it be like a character spirit where it's just like completely pointless, or is it just like? We'll have like an ability. No, it'll be Sakurai's like actual spirit. Like he'll go to some like blood sacrifice and split his spirit into multiple pieces. <laughs> you just see a ghost of Sakurai like in the in the background of every stage. <laughs> you just, they like just mail you a small like little jar with like a little bit of blue essence in it. It's like a pixie. <laughs> it's like this is Sakurai's essence. This, this is uh, Sakurai's ashes. <laughs> Ashes. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks for playing Smash Bros for this long. <laughs> Elden Ring? What is this? Another freaking. Gamer girl. Ooh. Whoa. Good. Oh, she hot. Girl. Good. Girl. G gamer. Girl. <laughs> Like, as well as there being a large variety to them, I just like looking at the chat because there's so much stupid drag queens are nasty. I'm just ignoring the chat. <laughs> Nintendo, let's go. 10 minutes. Something in German. Elden Ring. Is this a new Skyrim game or something? It looks like a new Skyrim game. It probably would. Or like, it probably is. I'm not. Another one of those, like, Dark Souls type games where, like, it's this the same thing. Open world roleplay survival game with big bosses and a big difficulty curve. Premium it bosses. Like, it looks exactly like Dark Souls. Dark Souls 2. Dark Souls 3, each of which Dark Souls 4. Character. Miyazaki says that it will be apparent there is an order to how players can tackle these six areas, but you don't have to follow it. The design of Elden Ring seemingly blends a bit of Demon Souls separate. The design of it is basically like Skyrim. <laughs> style of map. Speak up! I can't hear you. Everything when you start, but there are a lot of different ways you can approach each Shout! <laughs> Why is it in the Japanese or something? Map, which seamlessly connects to the lands between. There's even a hub, not unlike Dark Souls' Firelink Shrine, which players can branch out from that can be accessed a little later in the game. Very I'm ethereal quality. Do you know how many games have an ethereal quality? Probably like... Everything with this like stupid like medieval magic stuff. I guarantee you 50% of all video games is like magic knights and stuff. Yeah. Especially in Final Fantasy, like, like games yeah. and stuff. Speaking of Final Fantasy... Because Dark Souls did well, so a bunch of people made Dark Souls clones. Yeah. And uh, Skyrim did well, so a bunch of people make Skyrim clones. For Honor did well, so a bunch of people made For Honor clones. And had so much, so many knights. Like, yeah, it's cool, but it's kind of overdone. It's like zombies. It's overused, like, for, like, a long time now. <laughs> yeah. And yet people still get them. I forgot to watch the, uh... Uh, the E3, like, conference with Square Enix in it, to see if there's, like, another, like, Final Fantasy game coming in. Because I'm honestly down to get, like, another Final Fantasy game, even though I have not completed Final Fantasy 12 yet. 
other powerful beings who inherited should finish power Final Fantasy XII. <laughs> <shattered, laughs> causing them to fall into magic. All Only six minutes. In seven minutes. Words, <laughs> seven minutes to complete the other half of the game. <laughs> the gameplay of Elden Ring. Congratulations, you have seven minutes to beat it. Go, go, go. All right, we'll do. Skip. <laughs> Skip all of the fun parts and like just go story to story to story. Skip every cutscene. The thing about like open world games is that you can beat the game in like four hours. That is true. Like you can literally just like speed run it and like you just be like, well, this is you could probably okay. Yeah, you could probably beat Fallout 4 in like six hours if you just do main story after main story. But that's not the point of the game. It's probably not the point of like any game, though. Yeah. I mean, like, unless it's specifically story guided, like um, the Resident Evil games. Well, sort of, because you can like spend quite a bit of time like looking for loot. What do we all want to see from this? Now, I'm very interested in this one, Dan. You and I have been uh, going a little bit back and forth here. Of course, super massive game. Powered by DoorDash. <laughs> Obviously, they found success with We're going to make like Dragon Quest 15. And the next Smash Fighter is Hero 2. The same mechanics, but only slower and heavier. <laughs> they will do that, though. <laughs> DoorDash Man for Smash. <laughs> Tour dash guy for It's like some random ass guy. He's got like the Wario side P except it's just like a Honda Civic. No, I just black out and just use out of my brain like Pazuzu in this game coming to spook our people who were in Iraq and I think around 2003. Right. Ancient Sumerian mythology. It's going to be super fun. I'm very excited to see this. I want to have those jump scares with my friends. I hope they have that playable co op again. Yeah. I love this series. I'm excited to see what they have in store. Yeah, me, it's kind of funny. Me and Joey like to play these together, the Dark Picture Anthology. And that was the thing of, you know, talking about Man of Medan, right? Where it was, you know, playing through that together. You both are on the ship. Where are you going and how are you going to get out of it? And I think this is an interesting. Man of Median and uh, Dead really by Daylight. Right? Not Dead by Daylight. We are having a battle. American forces What's that other one he said? They fall in together into the Until Dawn? Those, those are both really good. Together. Now, Dave, yeah. before we got started, you're like, I don't know that much about the Dark Pictures anthology. Yeah. As a horror fan, yeah. do you more know Zelda. Whoa. Coming to video games, trying something different, because every one of these has a different set. Well, it's the Zelda. Yeah, it's a cool Among idea. Us for Smash. For Roblox. Mm -hmm. Among Us. Omega so, Lol for Smash. For video games in general, but for <laughs> Resident yeah. Sleeper for Smash. What's your thing? Kappa for Smash. Craigasm for Smash. The old Pog Champ emo for Smash. <laughs> the old Poggers thing. Among Us 2 for mobile. Did they just say Among Us for mobile? It's free on mobile. There is like a multiplayer element to it that I really, really like that everyone can pitch in on the decisions you need to make and see what the consequences are. Uh, and I think that's why people obviously gravitate towards the Dark Pictures anthology. Well, this could be like quite a bit of a lengthy video, but oh well. Although Jason's gonna be editing his, so. Uh... I don't know how to edit videos. So Me neither. Let's go hire Jason to edit my videos. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm just here for the content. Yeah, so for me, Google for Smash? Yo! You're just here for the food. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. The Siri girl for Smash. The Samsung girl for Smash. <laughs> Someone just said pee on me. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> We're wrong with people. That is an awesome backdrop. That is. <laughs> Holy cow. That place would just be so awesome to just walk into and look at. What would be your first thoughts if you haven't seen this before? Like, and you're just walking in on this? What would you think? And I was me or have, like, never had video game experience? Or never, like, had, like, like, seen this backdrop? Oh, I would have been, like... What movie is this for? <laughs> it looks like an alien movie kind of thing. Tron? You know I mean? <laughs> is this Tron 3? All three minutes. <laughs> Yokai Watch 4. <laughs> Goku for Smash. 
Mario and Fortnite. And I know that the whole E3 crew is extremely excited about what is coming up here. Two minutes and 39 seconds. I highly doubt that Fortnite won't get into Smash because uh, Epic Games tried to buy out Nintendo, but then Nintendo rejected them. Why would Nintendo sell themselves to Epic? <laughs> Epic is pretty much almost on the same level as Steam now. Yeah. They're becoming an actual competitor. Not only did they give me a free three months of Discord Nitro, but they also have like free games every week that are actually like pretty decent games. Yeah, like I don't see why they should like get any more. Uh, they probably I have mean, a better I'll, reason though, but uh, I oh, well. I'll stick to Steam because I love Team Fortress 2, but I'll definitely go to Epic for some things because they do have some better prices. I never, I never went to Epic for anything. Is one of my fondest Nintendo memories. Epic and, uh, has some good stuff. Two the first time on my Switch. Like they have, I yeah, Splatoon they have that like free game every week, which is. The they're usually they pretty decent games. Group, and, uh, I love watching all the streamers, all the events, whenever they're on. They're always. What if KK Slider yeah, actually makes it to Smash? KK um, Slider for Smash. What is going to be an Isabel and Villager? Yeah. <laughs> Echo Fighter, a double I'm Echo Fighter. Except that he's going to have a broken mechanic. <laughs> Yeah, he's got like a Jigglypuff go to sleep. Not not for upbeat, for neutral B. <laughs> neutral B. First neutral B. First neutral B. Sing Wilds KK. Emmett <laughs> from the Lego movie for Smash. Yeah. And um, I really feel like Where it comes. shaped who I am today. Oh yeah. And uh, I feel like those memories form me into the human being that I am. Yeah. And um, I, I do. Let's see. Rated M. Really uh oh. Really uh oh. Stinky. Uh, no All thirty seconds. Um, when I was a child. Too inappropriate for me. Oh you know, no. Was, was Ew. Mom. Home, you know? and Mom, don't walk in. I think this is the first oh, Nintendo maybe, Direct maybe, I watched at E3 live. Live. One of my favorite Super WrestleMania. Uh, I, I love yeah, um, I think this was the same for me as well. Um, and yeah, Royal Rumble, that was another good one. Like all the wrestling games, we loved those. So it was great. Great ones, but believe it or not, the Nintendo Yoshiaki Koizumi is an adorable name. In this right now, the second, go! Let's go! The Switch has been out for five years? Holy crap. Oh, wait, is it going to start right now? Yeah, it's starting right now. Oh. Pog. I don't care about the COVID-19 things, like, why did someone pass it? <laughs> There's two Japanese guys talking to me. Oh, it's a piece of hair! Sorry, I just got assaulted by a piece of hair. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. Okay, can this... Hello, I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll be your guide as well. Hi, I'm your guide. Hi, I'm your guide's brother. <laughs> GTA 6 for Smash. <laughs> Nintendo Switch is being enjoyed by a wide range of players spanning all ages and all levels of gaming experience. Not actual gameplay footage. So this is going to be Shadow of the Colossus. Shout out the Hedgehog for Smash. We've been able to offer a wide Oh wait, this is the Smash ad. Yeah. Not just from Nintendo, but I know they started it off with it. I, I think they did for the last one as well. But I don't know. This Nintendo Direct will be I know they did for uh, Sephiroth. Your personal tastes. Oh, it's a guy from Tekken. Yeah, it is cuz news on upcoming Nintendo Switch games. And yeah, we'll be Tekken, okay. A selection of games releasing this year. We hope you enjoy it. They got the classic punch sound effect. Okay, to begin, please. <laughs> Kale punch happens. Whoa. <laughs> His map looks. No cool. way. That's Ganondorf right there. <laughs> Is Breath of Wild 2 coming? <laughs> Phoenix right for Smash. <laughs> Yo, he's killing everyone. Hold up! 
Yo, we go sicko. Yo, bro. I didn't even see like the little intro thing, but okay, so another Shoto. <laughs> Oh. Um. So I'm like Aura. <laughs> Can't wait to get this dude in Elite Smash. <laughs> dude, the combos though. <laughs> oh, so he has like a Samus laser kind of thing. Oh, of course. Huh. Well, that looks interesting. <laughs> He's just throwing everyone off. <laughs> the arm. <laughs> oh, there he goes. There he goes. I swear, if they throw my boy Cloud off, then I'll be real upset. It just dropped Kirby off. Oh, would you look at that? A pretty much like limit thing or something, or a Sephiroth kind of thing. Yeah. Well, Tekken for Smash, damn. The stage looks nice though. It reminds me of a uh, King of, like, I think it's like King of Fighters or something. Yeah, I think Tekken did a crossover with Street Fighter one time. Finally, it's not a cutscene anymore. Oh well. <laughs> yeah, there it is. <laughs> no, 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 dude. This <laughs> Sternum smash. <laughs> he lives. <laughs> The dragon uppercut. Gates of Hell. I'm Masahiro Sakurai from Sora Limited and the director of the Super Smash. Yo, I thought you'd be tired. <laughs> Kazuya Mishima from the fighting game series Tekken will join the battle. So it looks like he has stronger grabs. Details at a later date. It really does. It looks like he. For today, though, we've prepared. Or his grabs are more like uh, the Mortal Kombat grabs, Smash where it's like Please take a look. more of an animation kind of thing. Yeah. I feel like it's just basically like Ken and Ganondorf combined or something. There's so many sleepers. <laughs> the entire chest is like, rest of the sleeper, Omega lol. Canada for Smash. Everyone's moldy for Crash right now. <laughs> is that next month? Or is that this month? Oh no, it's 26th this month. Wow. I can't wait for people to be like, no, rip Crash, <laughs> no. <laughs> Crash still has a chance. I mean, there's what, two more fighters? Uh, one more fighter. That's Actually, not two more because of bonus one. Yeah. This feels like Tekken. No! no. <laughs> Yo, is Telltale Games coming back? I'll talk about the fighter more in a future presentation. <laughs> Are you serious? It's gonna be like Life of Strange 3 actually. or something. Yeah. 6th, uh, June 28th, so... Basically, in like 13 days. Novel? Thank you, Mr. Sakurai. Hmm? Oh, it's Life of Strange 3! Oh my god, it's Life of Strange 3! Please look forward to seeing how Because those are three characters from the Life of Strange. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I didn't even enjoy Life of Strange. Of and it's gonna be on the Switch? Your choices matter in these emotional supernatural tales. What? It's off brand Telltale. <laughs> what if it is actually off brand Telltale? <laughs> That's what Life of Strange is it's off brand Telltale. It has very similar, like, I mean, it's got more gameplay than a Telltale game, but like, it has the same, like, your choices matter. Yeah. Talk to people, don't be a dick. <laughs> more Marvel stuff, okay. Remastered collection. <laughs> the Kami Dog. I saw a meme once where like, it's just like the bosses, uh, like what bosses look like uh, when you fight them. It's just like really amazing. And then the the bosses like once you like 
unlock him as a playable character. It's just like really stupid. Life is Strange Remastered Collection comes to Nintendo Switch later this year. Since when has there been a new Worms game? There's something for everyone on the Nintendo Switch system. You are Star Lord, leading a legendary no, band of heroes for hire in this thrilling action adventure game. <laughs> I'm not Jump gonna buy a Worms game. Me neither. That game was fun when you were like six. And now it's stupid. It, it looked cool, but now it doesn't. This looks like a mobile game. <laughs> and yet, this is coming to the Switch, apparently. There's a lot of mobile games that just came to Switch, just cause... Oh, of course. When, when you said worms. Worms. <laughs> Plus, the patchwork bear outfit exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version will be available for free for two weeks after launch. This is just like that one Doctor game. With Worms Rumble, wriggling onto Nintendo I, I might get Worms just for the free costume. Like, just to make myself look cool. <laughs> Why? I don't, I don't know, but like, I just want to flex on like whoever like got like a few months after. Oh, it's Monkey Ball. It's Monkey Ball. Nice. Monkey Ball remastered. Monkey Ball for Smash. Funny monkey. Monkey. Monkey Ball is an assist trophy. No, I'll be really depressed. In quirky world of two point county. In the wholesome man Why is this game coming to, to Smash? Or right, not coming to Smash, coming to the Switch. I played Monkey Ball on in a dentist office once, and that's the only time I've ever played Monkey Ball. <laughs> you never played like outside of the, the dentist office? No, I've only ever played it at the dentist office a couple times. <laughs> Super Monkey Ball. Cause mental brain damage. Cause permanent brain damage to a monkey. Monkey pool. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sick commercial. <laughs> Where it's just Whoa. staring at us. <laughs> Meh, I'll get this. Why not? A new Mario Party. Like, actually. Are you slightly behind? Yeah, yeah. Then. I'm you still on the monkey- the monkey ball. <laughs> oh. Well, they're what version are you- are you watching it on? <laughs> I'm watching it on Twitch. I think I got like... Loaded delayed. A little bit. Oh, uh, maybe. Uh, yeah, cause you're kinda of behind. I- I'll reset it. Or refresh okay. it. Why is there a bunch of resident sleepers in chat? Because it's a new Mario Party. Oh. Well, it's more of just like a bunch of Mario Party remastered and smashed into one. But there's no car. Oh, so sick, Nad. Even though I have ad blocker. Mario Party Superstars. Available the day before my birthday. Oh, Pog. I have a convenience store delivery for I don't think I'll get that. I might get that just for like whenever just like we hang out or something. Yeah, I mean, it, it definitely looks fun. I just don't think it says like unforgiving as the old ones, and that didn't, that makes it less fun. You think? Before we show uh, just I just trailer, came out after the one thing. the uh, Mori Party trailer or the latest game in the Metroid Prime like series, the really release date. Oh my God, a new Metroid! Oh my God, a new Metroid! Okay, clearly I'm still behind. <laughs> yeah, you're behind. Metroid Five. Please take a look. Dude, pog. Dude, so many people are pogging in chat. Can we get some poggy woggies in chat? Now, they'll pop off like once, like Pikmin 4 comes out or is revealed. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I mean, I mean, Metro looks sick though. Like the new Me Metro she's game. Got a new, yeah, she's got a new suit of armor. It's like white and stuff. Yeah, it is just straight up new Metro game. Damn. Okay. Watch this, like be, like foreshadowing, like new skin for Samus. <laughs> Metroid Dread is what it's called. Okay. What is this? A horror game now? A horror game slash Metroid game. <laughs> <laughs> now where's the new punch out? If they're bringing back old series that didn't get a bunch of games, well Metroid hasn't gotten a game in a while, and Punch Out hasn't gotten a game in a while. Uh, technically F-Zero has not gone in the game in like 20 years. Yeah, same with F-Zero. <laughs> but I think, I don't know if they're gonna make a new F-Zero because they already have Mario Kart, which is like their racing game. Yeah. It already sells really well. Among Us 2. Huh, Metroid oh Dread. Maybe I'll look into that. So wait, am I still am I still behind or something? Yeah, I think Metroid Dread just ended. Oh. Two point oh. Ninja. Point oh. I'm gonna go to art school and get declined. Can I please not have any heads? Bayonetta 3? No. Releases on October 8th. And new Samus Amiibos. Well, also, so I'm just waiting like for... A and I'm, a new Samus Amiibo. I'm just waiting for Jason to be like, Yo, I got a Samus Amiibo. <laughs> Brings out that. <laughs> Amiibo Familiar franchise. Just wow, Dance I'm... 2022, baby! <laughs> Samus and the Emmy. The robot. Uh, I can't... Do you want to get Just Dance 2022? <laughs> I've never gotten any of the Just Dances. <laughs> they're the... fun. I, but they're I agree with chat, though. Resident Sleeper. <laughs> Resident Sleeper, there's so many. What is this? Raw Thrills. Alright, I'm just, I'm, I'm just gonna... Cruising Blast. This looks like the game you'd find in an arcade. Alright, I'm just gonna end it here, because... Um... Or a mobile game. It looks like a <laughs> Resident Sleeper. Wait, did, did my thing finally fix itself? Influenza. Oh yeah, it's still behind. But... Uh, I'll end it here, um, and yeah, thanks you guys, thank you so much for watching.